are looking at the future cast for tomorrow afternoon. We will have clouds in there during the day. Those showers Dan we're talk was talking about don't arrive until tomorrow evening. You'll see that here on the future cast 730 PM. Now as we go through the night and showers overspread the whole area, you can see we're getting some pinks here in the Adirondacks. We do have a chance for freezing rain tomorrow night there. That's going to create some slick roads at higher elevations. You can see it's rain for the rest of us though through the night tomorrow night and into Thursday morning. We'll have a couple of pockets of moderate to heavy heavy rain possible and maybe even a rumble of thunder or two late Wednesday night here early Thursday morning. Notice at daybreak on Thursday we still have ice going in the Adirondacks but rain showers for the rest of us. That's in the morning. The rest of the day Thursday will end up pretty quiet on the cloudy side there but a nice lull in between showers. Looks like another round moving in for us on Thursday night. So believe it or not, even though we're in spring, we do have a winter weather advisory. That's for tomorrow night for that possibility of ice in the Adirondacks. We'll see some slick roads late night and especially early Thursday morning. The rest of us having all rain will not be under that advisory. Now that's the bad news. The good news is we can sugarcoat it a little bit here for you. Our sun setting later now is 7.15 p.m. Believe it or not, here today and tomorrow. A week from now, it gets closer to 7.30. It'll be 7.51 a month from now. And by the end of next month, they'll be setting after 8 p.m. We are gaining about three minutes of daylight per day now, not just with the sun setting later, but also with it rising a little earlier each morning. So overnight tonight, we've got partly cloudy skies. We've got those thin cirrus clouds overhead and we'll get down to 20 degrees. So another cold night cold in the morning and the afternoon we're in the mid 40s so kind of similar to today we will see mostly cloudy skies and breezy conditions there tomorrow it's in the evening when the showers arrive we've got some showers in the morning thursday most of the day they'll end up pretty quiet there upper 40s same for friday we're looking at a few sprinkles then things turn interesting this weekend we're getting cold again mid 40s Saturday with some rain showers and maybe a little snow mixing in does look like flurries now on Sunday and look at those high temperatures only in the mid 30s there that continues early next week. We'll see some nights in the teens as well. So this is why we've been saying do not jump the gun and plant your flowers early or pack away, you know, your winter clothes. So we'll be feeling like winter again, unfortunately, by the week. Got to hang out just a little bit longer.